Least Common Multiple, LCM. Least Common Denominator, LCD. Multiple is a number that can be divided by another number without a remainder. Example, 15 is a multiple of 5 since 15 divided by 5 equals 3. 20 is a multiple of 5 since 20 divided by 5 equals 4. Least common multiple, LCM, is also known as lowest common multiple, LCM and least common divisor, LCD, which when used in denominator part of fraction is known as least common denominator, LCD. The LCM of numbers is the smallest or lowest number that is evenly divisible by all numbers in the set. Question, what is the LCM of 6 and 8? First of the three ways on how to get the LCM is using the listing method. Here, you list all the multiples of 6 and multiples of 8. So for multiples of 6, we have 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, and so on. And for multiples of 8, we have 8, 16, 24, 32, and so on. Take note that you will continue listing the multiples of the given number until at least one of the multiples appears on all the list. In our case, one common multiple appears in the list of multiples of 6 and 8, and that is 24. Since 24 is the smallest common to the given numbers, therefore, LCM of 6 and 8 is 24. In getting the LCM using the listing method, list all the multiples of the given number until at least one of the multiples appears on all the list. Find the smallest number that is on all of the list. The second way on how to get the LCM is using the prime factorization. So in the example, what is the LCM of 6 and 8, you will factor 6 using the prime numbers, and these are 2 and 3. Since 2 and 3 are prime numbers, you will stop factoring. And for the number 8, you will factor the given number using the smallest prime number, and that is 2, together with 4. 2 is already a prime number. So you will leave it. And for number 4, continue factoring since it is not yet prime. Using the smallest prime factor 2 together with 2. Since 2 and 2 are already prime numbers, you will stop factoring. Therefore, the prime factors of 6 are 2 times 3. And for 8, 2 times 2 times 2. In this list of prime factors, you could see a pair of common prime factors, and that is 2. Finally, multiply the prime number common to the set together with the rest of the prime factors in the list of factors. So you'll have 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 equals 24, and that is the LCM of 6 and 8. In getting the LCM using the prime factorization, get a pair of factors for the given number. Continue factoring until the number cannot factor anymore. List all the prime factors of the given number. Select the pair or pairs of common prime factors among the list of factors. Multiply the number used in a pair or pairs of common prime factors together with the other prime factors of the numbers. The third way of getting the LCM of the numbers is with the use of the ladder method or continuous division. In this method, you will divide the given numbers continuously using prime numbers. In the question, what is the LCM of 6 and 8, first step is to write the given numbers in the topmost ladder. Then, 
you will divide evenly any or all of the given numbers using the smallest prime number, and that is 2. Dividing the first row, 6 divided by the prime number 2 is 3, and 8 divided by the prime number 2 is 4. Be sure to put the answer below the given numbers that you are dividing. Since the numbers are 3 and 4, you will continue dividing the number using again the smallest prime number 2. So with the number in the second row, 3 cannot be divided evenly by 2, so you will bring down 3. Meanwhile, 4 can be divided evenly by 2, and the answer is 2. Since the numbers in the third row are not yet 1s, so you will continue dividing using again the smallest prime number 2. So with the number in the third row, which is 3, it cannot be divided evenly by the prime number 2, so you will bring down again the number. And for the number 2, it can be divided evenly by the prime number 2, so the answer is 1. Take note that the numbers in the ladder are not yet 1s, so you will have to continue dividing. Using the numbers in the fourth row, the only smallest prime number that can be divided exactly by 3 is 3. So 3 divided by the number 3 is 1. And for the other number, which is already 1, you will just bring down the number. Take note that the last ladder are all 1s, so you will end here. Finally, multiplying all the prime numbers used, 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 equals 24. And that is the LCM of 6 and 8. In getting the LCM using the ladder method, write the given numbers on the top of the ladder. Starting with the first row, divide evenly any or all of the given number using the lowest prime number. Write the answer just below the given number. If the number cannot be divided evenly, just bring it down. Continue dividing until the numbers in a row are all ones. Multiply all the prime numbers used.